I'm a feminist. And what that means to me is much the same as the meaning of the fact that I am black. It means that I must undertake to love myself and to respect myself as though my very life depends upon self-love and self-respect. June Jordan. Beauty, Leader, beauty, unique, the beauty, strong, the beauty, soulful, the beauty. the beauty in black. Love, love black women. Uh, I wish that black women would uh, stop having that that, uh, that leaves and stuff. We're underrated and uh, misunderstood, but uniquely different. We serve a purpose here, and uh, I'm proud to be black. I think that they're, uh, they're definitely unappreciated because they're multi-talented mm -hmm. and multi-tasked and we need to definitely acknowledge that. My problem is is that uh, they, I wish black women had more uh, sticking together, more com mm -hmm. camaraderie, camaraderie, yeah. keepness, but just be more uh, together, that sisterhood thing like it used to be back in my day. I feel like a lot of black women get passed up a lot of things. And we have to struggle a lot harder to get where we are. Black women are misunderstood mainly because of black men. They are so strong, black women are so strong, so nurturing until uh, black men think that, uh, well, uh, we're that, needy. Yeah, we're, we're, uh, we're needy. Uh, that you're... So we have the lack thereof. Maybe if they give black girls a chance, we can all fit in together. Because we're not that different from others. We're just a different skin tone. Mm. A lot of black women also don't have their mothers or their fathers around to help them to get where they are. We're tribal. Yeah. Where do you think we come from? We're mother of the earth. going to more predominantly white schools, you were always like an anomaly because you stuck out. And so they were always full of questions, questions like, what do you eat? And I'm thinking, what do you eat? I eat the same thing you eat, food, normal stuff. Doesn't everybody eat the, you know, eat the same menu? When I was younger, like around like 12, I really didn't think about it. And then once I got like older, I really started, you know, noticing stuff. Like in high school, you know, the white girls at my school, they'll wear like shorter shorts. And when a black girl comes to my school and wears some short shorts, it's like, man, it's a big deal. I am the lowest paid statistically it has been proven. African American women, no matter the training, education, the vocation, are the lowest paid employees in the workforce. Get treated differently. It's not easy at all, actually. Um, people would think that it's not a big deal just because of the time we live in, but it really is. It changes a lot of how your life will go. Not for it could be for the worse or the better, but it changes people's opinions of you. When you walk in the room, you are black. I do feel like sometimes I do have to work harder to prove myself because. Walking in a room as a black woman, you're automatically, oh, she can't do the job. It's not for her. You have to prove them wrong. Hair doesn't make you what color you are. Just because I have curly hair doesn't make me any less of a black girl. Or just because somebody's hair is, is nappy doesn't make them necessarily that they're black. It's, it's just... It's hair. Everybody thinks that everybody that's black has short hair. It's not, it's the stuff that we put in our hair, like perms and stuff like that. I just feel at the end of the day, we're all black. And it's, it's, it's discrimination against each other because white people, they look at us and it's not, it's not, oh, she's really dark or oh, she's light, it's she's black. Education. So many African American women are going after that brass ring and it does my heart proud to see that happening. And these younger women, they have so much get up and go and passion about whatever vocation or profession that they are pursuing. And we are in mass numbers in higher learning institutions in record numbers. We, they understand, we understand the importance in the can't beat them, join them mentality. I am happy, parents, 
soulful and loving. Most of all, I am a black woman.